just, uh, let's see, this is one loading screen, then we got Vegas, and we've got that one, and uh, there's like four more loading screens. If I counted correctly, there's, should be somewhere around, somewhere around four. Counting this one. Because it's this one, and then the one to get into New Vegas, and then the one past the Lucky 38. Uh, and then there should be one, one more. I think. That was one, this is two, three, four, yeah. Like four or five loading screens. Oh, Boone's killing somebody. Oh, Boone, kill him! Ew, god, that guy was ugly. He got shot in his armpit, too. Oh, he's killing somebody else. Huh. As long as he doesn't accidentally shoot one of these robots and get us both killed, I'm... I don't give a fuck who he shoots. To the strip. To the strip we go. Indeed. Whoops, didn't mean to do that. Go away. Go away. Go Xbox guy. God damn it. Stupid thing didn't want to go away. Look at all the lights. Looks so fancy. So fancy. What is this place? I've always wondered what this place is. Let's go ahead and stop in and see. Door to Las Vegas Boulevard Station. Eh, I don't really want to. Come on. Really? They won't let me jump? Uh, oh, there. There. Just make it quicker. Fallout Man takes no falling damage. Pretty much. He takes a very little amount of falling damage. Unless you jump off of the Hoover Dam. Actually, I've jumped off the Hoover Dam and lived. Because you fall into water. That's the only reason. If you were to jump off the Hoover Dam onto land, you'd probably die. Actually, I'm, I guarantee I guarantee you'd fucking die. I don't give a fuck what you have to say. Go away. Okay, now we gotta find this Liz... Lisa Liz O'Malley. God knows where she's gonna be. Alright. So... Aha. Whoops. Welcome to the NCR Whoops. Embassy. How can I help you? Ah, excellent. I received word you may be coming. We helped the receptionist over at Gomorrah with some thugs that were taking advantage of her. She owes us a favor. Go talk to her. She'll be able to point you in the right direction. Sir? I wonder why she's wearing a dress. Why is she not dressed like a NCR soldier? Must be her day off or something. Begin your odyssey with Poseidon Energy. Hmm. I've never found a place called Poseidon Energy. Lost a month. Well, that's your fucking fault for gambling. Stupid. Vault 21 Hotel. Yeah, because I totally want to pay to sit in a fucking vault. Have you played Fallout 3? The vault is like the worst place ever. That place is so damn boring. 
Like, I don't know why you'd pay to stay the night in a vault. Oh, look at those fancy dressed people. Mr. Cowboy Hat. called your face ding dong I've been married for 17 years where did I go wrong oh my cousin okay I'm leaving I can see why he's standing on the curb uh, doing that and not actually making money he fucking sucks That, that was a very, very bad comedian. Why is Chuck Norris on a $20 bill? Hmm. Weird. Seriously? Hey, Jeez. no one but Omeritas are allowed to carry guns into Gamora. Check your weapons with me. You'll get these back on your way out. As long as I get all of them, motherfucker. I've counted. I've counted. I know. Alright. Do I have any holdout weapons? I... Uh, I do not. Fantastic. Hello, and welcome to Gamora. What can I help you with today? I knew someone would call in that mark soon. What do you want to know? <coughs> Sorry about that. Some of the girls say he's been involved in some shady business the family wouldn't really like. Ask him about it. I sure do. But loose lips? <laughs> Sink ships. All right. You look pretty trustworthy. Wow, these people are stupid. I hear you've actually been inside, Lucky 38. You're the first person who's been in there in as long as anybody can remember. Well, okay. That was... She didn't have any secrets. She didn't have any good secrets. Where's the thing? Why is it telling me to go... Okay, I'm not gonna listen to that thing anymore because I don't know where it's wanting me to go. What quest do I have activated? I do have the right one. Right? Investigate the immortals and stop them. Okay, yeah. And she said to talk to somebody, and I think that somebody is in here. I may be wrong. I think it's this guy. I hear you've been asking yeah. questions about me, dickweed. What the fuck do you want? Business. What the fuck do you mean, business? You looking to get yourself burned? Now you start talking real clear, and I mean fucking crystal clear, because I'm about to lose my patience. We've been talking for 10 seconds and you're about to lose your patience? You don't have very many, do you? That's pretty sad. I don't give half a dick what you heard. Now get the fuck out of my face before I burn your sorry ass. Half a dick? What the fuck is wrong with this guy? Good thing is, I remember what to do here. There we go. And now we talk to him. You would... Where the fuck did you get that? Okay, listen, buddy. That's some dangerous shit you got there. That book can get me killed if the wrong people see it. Let's talk. What do you want? What can I do for you? I want caps. Okay, you got me by the balls. Here's a couple hundred caps. Maybe that'll buy you friendship. I can pay you for it, of course. I also have some information about the family's business that you might find interesting. Between you and I, we can break up what they're planning, maybe save some lives. Mine included, of course. Oh, here's some caps. Now give me the journal. All right, there we go. So let me tell you what I know about the family's business. The bosses, Big Sal and Nero, have been working for a while on this. They're arming themselves like an army, using this new guy, Troik. They also brought in a specialist named Clandon. At least that's what they introduced him as. 